Hey guys, welcome back to another planet. Today, I made a planet and it has some very interesting features. So, um, stay tuned. Okay, so I built this vehicle right here. Um, this vehicle is very special because of this map is very special. So the vehicle had to be special. So get in the vehicle, you know, it's got the, you know, it looks pretty normal. It's kind of weird that, oh, oops, I accidentally pressed the button before I was ready. Yeah, if you're familiar with makers you can see that that is the tractor beam how am I doing this if uh, the floor is not magnetic okay um I had to step away for a second so I don't remember what I was saying um so the map it's super simple at the moment. I'm probably going to add some more stuff. Um, this thing has a problem with uh, not being able to strafe. So if I go over this, this doesn't have... Oh, oh, the map. The What's in the floor. So in the floor of this map, there is the same thing that I used to make the monorail not a monorail yeah yeah monorail right so it's just like I don't think it, maybe I can see in the ground wait why is my camera sideways what in the world oh wow I integrated it really well so, yeah, it's literally at the same level as the ground. Um, but, yeah, I put the block that just keeps it, uh, the magnet block. And I just made it static and put it literally across the entire world. So, if I go over this part over here, I'll stay at the same level because the magnets are underneath the uh, main floor. Oh, also, uh, there's, there's a bit of, like, you know... Ah! It likes to drift forward or backward. Um, also, the uh, this maps or slash planets lore is, like, you know... The gravity is like two times. Um, it like has giant, a giant crystal over here. Look, I made the terminals uh, the right size this time. Um, for some reason, I can go right through this building. Um, it's not. Oh, but I can't go through the top. What? Oh. That's confusing. But yeah, just just a giant crystal here over here. Now there's supposed to be Yeah, I can just literally walk right through. I don't know what's wrong with this map uh, building. I think it's because I scaled it down and the walls don't like to be scaled down. I think that's the problem. So, there's supposed to be a spaceship in the sky, like a really big one. But, I don't know where it is. Uh, or how to get there. So, let's go to the vehicle. So, I just have a bunch of tractor beams in here. Just, you know, five, six, you know, uh, five. Yeah. We just have five tractor beams in there. I have 
the UFO engine? Not really. No. What? This is not an engine. This is the hover glitch, I guess. Where basically it keeps your thing from moving side to side. So or up and down, but whatever direction you want it to. See, when I turn sideways, I stop going sideways, and then I go forward. I tried to make it like not too futuristic because all of this stuff is like industrial. Wait, hold on. Aren't these, um, magnetic? Aren't these magnetic? So technically I should. Ah, uh, yep. Yep, I fly on top of them. Because they're also magnetic. Oh! What the heck? Holy cow. Wow. Um, I think I broke the sound barrier or something. Um. But yeah, just have it on a toggle. Uh, I need to, like, get it to stop when I release the gas but um I think this mm, this map um might have big plans in the future so I need ideas on what I should put on here because um yeah, right now it's just like super barren waste. Like, also, I have it at night time because um, there's supposed to be like, you know, no sun or anything. Um, but that means there wouldn't be a moon either. Uh, or like, the moon wouldn't shine. But, you know, whatever. Also, it's really, really bright. For being the middle of the night, really bright. Uh, the map is called um, 198. I went with that because literally I just typed in some random numbers. But then I was like, wait, maybe it could stay numbers because of what? Just the lore behind it, right? So I'm going to keep adding to it. Um, it's going to be part of a large project. That guy was pretty strong. Also, this thing is really fast because it's basically just using hover blocks almost, but not really. So yeah, it's pretty quick. It goes about 200 miles an hour, which is pretty good for how weird the aerodynamics are. Whoa, a little, a little weird there. It's a little twitchy though. I need to make it a little better for driving. It's not very nice to drive. And also, it kind of hits the ground pretty hard. Yeah, I think that's that's it. I literally threw this together this morning. So, that that's why it doesn't look that good. Yet, comment down below what y'all want to see in this map. What y'all want to see in general, like, um, in the game. December 2nd is our one year anniversary so excited for that had this channel for an entire year my first video was well full length video I think I put out a short before that but you know it, we're not counting that yeah can't wait for that I hope this video has earned you a subscription if not maybe there's other videos of mine that maybe you think is more accepting of a subscription also it's free so literally cost you nothing and helps me out a ton this has been Groot we'll see y'all in the next one bye